please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What up, what up, what up, Jupiter? I'm Madison Glode. And I'm Kirsten Fisher. And as always, we have your JHS Student News for Wednesday, October 27th, 2021. The boys' golf team came in second place at the district tournament and will move on to regionals next week. The Warriors lost a heartbreaker by a total of just two strokes. Freshman Tristan Whelan shot an even par 72 to record this low score in the event. Now congratulations to our girls' golf team. Zoe Shami, Emma Sazhill, Julia McCormick, McKenna Bernstein, Helena DeBlock, and our first year coach, Emily Valentin, for on coming home with the district runner up trophy. Volleyball regional quarterfinals ticket requests are available on the athletics link tree found in our social media profiles or at this link. The form will turn off at 1 p.m. today. If you would like to attend the volleyball game for a discounted price, make sure you turn out the form. National Honor Society will be supporting Toys for Tots. There is a box in front of the school and a box in the media center. You can donate the toys with the label containing your name, student number, and grade. Community service hours will be provided, 2 to 10 hours for your participation. Any questions, stop by and see Mrs. Sparks in room 1155, periods 1 through 6, and both lunches. Drive will end November 30th. Hours will be emailed to you, or you can stop by Mrs. Sparks' room. Jupiter Christian League, come join the most inspirational club on campus Thursday morning at 7.10 a.m. in Portable 3. A student will present a Bible verse, discuss it, and will end in a prayer and have a Dunkin' Munchkin along the way. Where two or more are gathered, Jesus will be there. Hope to see you tomorrow morning. The club is open to all students and staff. Sam Club members, community service alert. Weather permitting, we will be cleaning the beach and passing out sunscreen this Saturday, October 30th, me at 10 a.m. at Carlin Park for Donuts. See you in the sun safely. Are you interested in getting involved with the largest philanthropy project on our campus? If so, join us for our first dance marathon meeting on Friday, October 29th in Mr. Hammond's room, Portable One, right after school at 245. Come and find out how you can get involved in organizing and raising money for Children's Miracle Network at Chance Hospital. Whether you, involved, whether you were involved last year or this year, will be your first year, all are welcome. And now more ways to help raise money for Children's Miracle Network. You can purchase a Pira Vita bracelet for yourself or your significant other. Pira Vita bracelets are handcrafted by artisans around the world and are as unique as the person getting them. These bracelets cost $8 and were special ordered and designed by Grace Lovely and Mary McCommon. I know those people. Our overall captains for Dance Marathon. If you would like to purchase this specially designed bracelet, stop by Portable One or see a Dance Marathon member. I'm sure they look lovely, seeing as those two people, the captains, are also lovely people. Boys basketball. There will be a mandatory meeting for all interested in trying out for boys basketball on Thursday, October 28th, directly after school in Coach JD's room, 6106. Please be sure to let Coach know if you cannot make it. National French Honor Society. There will be a mandatory meeting today during lunch B in Portable 31. Attention fellow ninth graders. The Johnson Take Stock program will be recruiting on campus during both lunches on November 2nd. If you are interested in applying, come see the representatives during both lunches on November 2nd in the courtyard to get the application and learn more about the program which partners with Palm Beach County School District. Black Student Union meets today after school in Mrs. Carlisle's room 5211. The green team is selling ghost lollipops at lunches before school, or you can find a green team member with a box. They are frightfully fun. The Hispanic Heritage Foundation's 2021 Youth Awards Educational Grants Program is now accepting applications for the graduating class of 2022 for up to $4,000 to fund their higher education. Students can apply at www.hispanicheritage.org. Yearbook picture makeup makeups and retakes are today under class faculty and staff can get photographed anytime between 7 30 and 2 45 for the 2022 yearbook and to update your picture in sis latinas in action is collecting travel size bottles of soap as well as bars of soap for students and families of jupiter elementary we will be in the courtyard from 7 to 7 25 a.m through november 3rd 
please donate and receive community service hours. The Best Buddies Matching Party is this Friday, October 29th. Please go to your to room 4217 during your lunch. Pizza and drinks will be served. Only students who have signed up for Best Buddies online will be able to join us. My Friend's Closet is collecting clothing for the next few weeks. Bring your donations to Ms. Ellis' room 4118 to receive community service hours. You may help at the clothing drive or assist in organizing clothes beforehand. Join the Google Classroom for any slash all questions. There will be an ROTC College Scholarship briefing on November 1st at 1 p.m. in the cafeteria. Sign up with the QR code link. And now the moment you have been waiting for, that is right, we have the birthdays of the day. Happy birthday to Genesis Castellanos, Caitlin Cudo, Lauren Cudo, Annabelle Day, Leonardo Donati, Glendy Gomez-Soy, and last but certainly not least, Tatum Jacobs. I hope you all have a very happy birthday. And that is all the news we have for today. Kirsten, any final words to end off this announcement? Have a nice day, warriors. And now for your moment <laughs> of silence.